in my room, A Book of Creativity and Imagination by Joe Wittek, illustrated by Christine Rousey. How are you today, my friends? How are you today? I hope that you're okay, my friend. Oh, deep in my heart, and baby Sue's, we wanted to say, we hope that you're okay today. Boom. Hey, baby Sue, do you notice I'm wearing my Where the Wild Things Are socks today? Yeah, I know she doesn't care, but sometimes you do. I hung out with Sarah today, and Sarah picked out this entire outfit. She picked out cargo shorts and a tie-dye shirt and where the wild things are, socks. And I'm also wearing, uh, let me remove my shoes so I can show you the shoes I'm wearing. I've started jogging again. I haven't been jogging in quite a while. So I've started jogging again and I got an advertisement from a shoe company called Brooks and they made a shoe for the Pittsburgh Marathon. Isn't that so cool? Yeah. It says Pittsburgh right there. And you have bridges. You have the skyline of the city. And the really cool thing for Mr. Greg, I'll tell you what the cool thing is. Let me take the other shoe off. I'll put my face right here as I'm taking the shoe off. Isn't it fun to see my face very large? <laughs> I don't know that it is, but you get to see my face very large. So when I'm running, um, I may have told you this before, but when, uh, when I was very young, I needed to have braces on my feet and ins inserts, uh, braces on my legs, uh, uh, because I had some, uh, some, some physical disabilities with my legs. And even today, sometimes when I walk or run, my feet kind of go outward. And um, I've had to really work at when I run, running with each foot going forward instead of going out or in. And you can see that the two bridges and the fountain at the point, those two bridges point forward. And so all I have to do is look down briefly and I can make sure that I'm running straight. It's very cool. And then, of course, as you've seen before, there is a monster, and there is Max. And I have an entire series of these books. Do you remember when we read In My Heart? I do, because when I sang this song, I sang, Deep in my heart, and I pointed to it. So for this one, I could have said, uh, here in my room, I want to say, hope that you're okay today. And here's a fantastic, so these illustrations are so beautiful. Do you remember? It's a very awesome book. The, the other one was too. Um, you can even see on the back, our main character. She's very cute. But when we open the book, I can, can you see something here? There's no splash page, but the book is naturally telling me to put it this way to make it into a house. Isn't that so cool? Isn't that so cool? I think that's so cool. Okay, so I'm going to move off this way and we're going to read the book. Okay? Okay? Okay. Here we go. So we'll let the, the pages fall downward like this. In my room. And we start off with a beautiful illustration, as always. In my room, I can go anywhere I want to go and be anything I want to be. All I need is paper, crayons, chalk, and my imagination. Today, I want to be an explorer. 
Watch out for the crocodiles, Lily. Do you see that crocodile at the bottom? <laughs> Watch out for the crocodiles, Lily. I see hundreds of them swimming in the river. Quick, Lily, catch my rope and jump to the bed. Whew! We escaped. Have you ever pretended that the floor is lava or that there are sharks or crocodiles on the floor and you have to jump on various blocks or pillows or things to avoid them? I've done that before. Well, that's what Lily is doing here. And Lily is both the explorer and the person who needs to be saved. Next, I'll be a princess. Look at how my gown twirls to the music. Do you like my sparkling jewels? My glittery barrettes? I feel so beautiful. But how does mom walk in these shoes? <laughs> Do you ever wonder that? I often wonder that how any person who walks in very tall heels does so. Because as I showed you, Mr. Greg, all of my shoes have to be very flat and very squishy and very comfortable. I don't understand how people walk in heels. But they are beautiful, aren't they? And I do see the beautiful jewels and a beret. And there's some flags up above. Okay, we're going to let the next page fall. Boop. Oh, that's a beautiful illustration. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Now I'm a speed racer. Zigging and zagging, I race my red car in the city streets. I'm as fast as the wind. What a thrill. There were so many S sounds there. Did you hear them? I race with my red car through the city streets. I'm as fast as the wind. And so many S's. It looks like sometimes I'm looking down, but what I need to be doing is looking into the camera. Then it looks like I'm looking at you, right? But sometimes I look down at my face and it doesn't look like I'm looking at you anymore. I have to get used to this front-facing camera, don't I? I really appreciate how she's made uh, these buildings uh, upside down and these buildings right side up. So everything is very topsy-turvy. Oh, this is pretty. What's happening here? Although, look at the expression on Lily's face. It looks perhaps a bit worried, if not frustrated to me. Let's see what she has to say. Playtime is over. It's time for school. Well, that makes sense. <laughs> Who knows about the ABCs and how to count to 10? Very good, class. We've learned enough for today. Now it's snack time. Looks like Lily has set up school and she's being a very serious teacher. It's not that she doesn't want to go to school, but she feels that as a teacher, she needs to be very serious. Are your teachers very serious? Yeah, my teachers aren't very serious uh, either. Uh, I really love that my teachers are kind and can be really um, uh, joking and funny. But at the same time, they let me know what I need to learn and what I need to do. It's a very busy day at the office. Oh, she's at the office now. Click, clack, click, clack, 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 clack. I type away at my keyboard. Ring, ring. Hello? Uh, Lily, is that you? I can't play right now. I have too much work to do. Clack, 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 clickety, clack. I write hundreds of very important letters. Ring, ring. Hello, Lily, is that you again? What do you want? Okay, fine. You can come with me to the post office. <gasps> oh, this illustration is so beautiful, isn't it? My goodness. Such a large ocean and wave. A storm is brewing. Hold on tight to the sail, grizzly. I can't see anything through this rain. Look out! It's a pirate attack! Teddy bears, stand on guard! Dolls, fire the cannons! Boom! Boom! Pow! We sank their ship. Ooh. See, this one is very swoopy and round. It looks like Grizzly is surfing. Whew! 
All this pretending makes me hot. It's time to cool down at the beach. I put on my bathing suit and relax on my towel. Ah, <sighs> smell that fresh ocean air. I think I'll go for a swim. And look who's at the bottom here. We've got an octopus and a turtle and fish and plenty of plants. Oh, these are beautiful sunflowers. So many beautiful sunflowers. What's happening here? Lee and I are getting married. I'm the bride and he's the groom. And then, just for fun, we switch. And now he's the bride and I'm the groom. We take lots of silly photos for our wedding album. So much pretending going on here. Ooh, what's happening here? Oh, poor little kitty. You're hurt. But don't worry, I'm a veterinarian. I can help you heal. I'll wrap this bandage around you one, two, three, four, five times. Mummy cat, come back. I still have lots of bandages left. Do you remember how baby Sue didn't really want to be in my arms earlier? I think that's what's happening for Lily's cat. Uh, Lily's trying to wrap the cat so many times, perhaps in toilet paper, and the cat has run away. <laughs> Has it ever happened to you when you're trying to play with your cat? We're getting very near the top of the colors of the house. Right? Do you remember we had, we've been through uh, yellow and pink and orange and green and very light pink and red. Ooh, and that's, what was that fun one? Oh, that was the one where she was the teacher. And red and purple, and here's a fun cloud. And anyway, we're now uh, all the way to, or, ooh. Ooh, it's a rock band. And a one, a two, a one, two, three, rock out! It's the final performance of our band's world tour, tour, tour. I play my guitar solo, and the crowd goes wild. I scream and shout and get all of my wiggles out. Yeah, yeah! Back in my room, I'm a little girl again. But I'm as brave as an explorer, as beautiful as a princess, and as smart as a teacher, too. Today was a busy day. Who will I be tomorrow? And there's a, a splash page at the very end with beautiful clouds and rain and rainbows. And there's Lily on the back. You notice we, we've already read In My Heart, um, and then there's Hello in there, and then there's Brave As Can Be. I have this one. We can read this one soon. And All My Treasures. I think I have All My Treasures. I have two more of these books. I can't remember which two. It was fun hanging out with you today. I hope to see you again very soon. I love hanging out with you. And um, bye. Bye, baby Sue. Yeah.